For the third consecutive year, scholarship money was awarded honoring the late Dave Vino, a former Springfield state representative and social justice advocate. 22 News reporter Cy Becker attended the occasion on the steps of Springfield City Hall. Dave Vino passed away two years ago from pancreatic cancer at the age of 83. But not before gaining the respect and the admiration for many in the city he served. Former legislative colleague Paul Caron heads up the prestigious selection committee that awards scholarships to worthy students. I think it's his passion that he put in things that he believed in, and he loved mentoring young people. And to me, the best tribute that we can pay to Dave's memory of uh, Dave's constant activism is to continue his mentoring of young people. And for the first time, more than one scholarship was awarded at the request of the daughter of Dave's longtime companion. Because of the diversity of the applicants, they promised to continue Dave's social justice agenda. I didn't know much about Dave before this, and I seen the work that he did, and I was moved. I seen a bit of myself in him. I want to say thank to all the people that helped me how to speak English, and I want to thank people that give me this scholarship. Paul Karen pointed out Dave Vino's social activism, going down south in the 1960s and being arrested for helping register African American voters. This became the basis for the movie Mississippi Burning. Working for you in Springfield, Cy Becker, 22 News.